Well, here I am again. It's been a busy day. Okay, so today, um, now I'm at 8213 Salsa. I will be getting on the market in the next one or two days. It's a three bedroom, two bath, two and a half bath, which is awesome to have that extra half bath for guests in the living room. So if your kids have a messy bathroom, it's a Jack and Jill bath. So um, you have a bathroom where guests can go. <laughs> they don't have to experience uh, a mess. And uh, beautiful tile work, built-in cabinets. I'm gonna show it to you right now. Okay, I'm gonna turn it around on salsa. Okay, it's got good curb appeal. Can you see that? I've got my sunglasses on, so it's a nice landscaping. Nice curb appeal, okay. Hey, awesome neighbors. There's, there's the owners talking to the neighbors. And um, here we go. Huge uh, driveway, as you can see, plenty of parking, which is great for guests and street parking. Okay, you walk into a nice high tray ceiling, um, uh, entertainment nook there, which is pretty cool. And formal dining area, okay. A lot of people put art and stuff up there. And when I back away, there's some just nice little finishing touches. You've got the tile, you've got the built-in, you've got this, you've got arches, okay? Crown molding, molding. Um, just a little charming. Not a huge living room, but um, now, sorry, I had a call come in. Now we're in the informal dining area, okay? And got the, the office nook, you know, a little phone bill ping nook right there. You've got an Eden counter here. The refrigerator stays, built-in microwave, oven, uh, dishwasher, okay, that all stays in this house. We will not warranty the refrigerator. <laughs> I keep saying that. Okay, here we go. Now I'm walking back towards the living room, okay, and when I stand in the living room, I look left, and there's the kitchen and the master bedroom and the laundry room towards the garage. If I look right, then you've got the guest rooms over here to my right. So let's go to the guest room wing here. I forgot to turn on the lights, I apologize. Okay, you have one bedroom here. Okay. Little linen closet right there. Go left, and you have this other bedroom. Closet here, okay, closet. Nice bedroom here. And now we have the bathroom. Okay, this is a Jack and Jill bath. Nice big sink area. Hold on, let me turn on the lights. And um, shower, easy to clean. Okay. And this bathroom, toilet area. Okay. And now. I am going to go towards the master bedroom, okay? This master bedroom is split from the other two. I look left here, and this is where our half bath is, which is very handy, okay? Very handy half bath, so when you have guests over or your living room, you don't have to go to the Jack and Joe bath, which I like because I have lots of kids and I make a mess in their bathroom a lot of times. This laundry area has a lot of built-ins, which is awesome. Very functional, okay? Then you've got the master bedroom. It's a really good size, as you can see. You've got a couch, you've got a huge dresser, a big bed, and you are still good to go. Although that is a queen bed, you still have plenty of room. Okay, and now we're in the master bathroom. Nothing fancy, but very functional with his and her sinks. Um, a bathtub without jets, which some people like, some people don't, but I like it because the jets can break and get nasty and suck in dirty water. Also, you have a walk-in shower, okay? And two walk-in closets, his and her closets, which is awesome, okay? And of course, a private potty. We have lots of shelving in here. See, you can go potty in the bookshelves or linen. Um, okay, so just take a look as we go out. Okay, look at me. Hi. <laughs> now, I'm going back through the house. 
um, go through the kitchen. Okay, it's nice because the kitchen faces the backyard, so if you have kids, this can be the little play area. You know, if you want to keep this, um, I make this in my house where I watch the kids where they have their little play area table where they do their homework, play with their toys, keep an eye on them. Then when they're outside, you can open up the windows and keep an eye on them while they're playing outside. Okay, a covered patio. Beautiful house, dokey dokey. Oh, I locked the door, hold on. <laughs> Be smarter than the door. Okay, then you come out, you have a nice big patio. Okay. The yard's not big, but very functional and a good size. Um, exterior of the home's in good shape. Got a little dog run AC over there. And okay. Voila! Hey Roxanne, sell my house. <laughs> it's coming up. I need to sell this. Okay. Anyway, enjoy. I will post it soon so you can once again watch the whole video. There I go.